Governor Reynolds extends Iowa's COVID-19 disaster proclamation with some adjustments Iowa Governor Kim Reynolds is planning to give an update on the state's COVID-19 response at 11 a.m. Wednesday. Reynolds said Wednesday the state's disaster proclamation, which expires at midnight, will be extended through Wednesday, December 16, with some changes, which will be re-evaluated next week. Organized sports for youth and adults may resume, she said, but spectator limitations still apply and will be extended to cheerleaders, band members, and others performing at high school sporting events. Bars, restaurants, and other venues serving alcohol are directed to have last call at 10 p.m. Additionally, noting a decline in COVID-19 hospitalizations, the state will ease elective procedure restrictions from 50 percent to 25 percent, Reynolds said. It had been set to expire on Thursday. The changes include organized sports and recreational events, including bowling leagues, may resume for youth and adults, but spectators are still limited to two per participant. The same two-spectator rule applies to high school athletes, cheerleaders, band members and others performing at high school sporting events. To ensure better consistency among restaurants, bars, and other venues that serve alcohol, including casinos, last call for service will be at 10 p.m. The state is easing restrictions on elective procedures from a 50% reduction to a 25% reduction. The state will be monitoring virus activity and will make a decision about further changes next week.